What's up, guys? Now, I know a lot of you uh, were ripping on me for returning my LG CX 55 inch. For all you guys that said that, I apologize. I'm humbled by going the wrong direction and getting this Samsung Q800 8K TV, guys. is gross. I'm very disappointed in the Samsung TV. I was so excited, so hyped to get 8K at home, but the upscaling on this TV is just awful. It makes everything look splotchy and, and, and just overly smooth and no detail at all. The colors are, are neonish, gross, off color, just not even the same thing. Not, not even colors that I'm used to seeing. The black levels are horrendous. What black levels? There is no black levels. I've tried tweaking the picture on this TV as far as I can. It does not look good. It's not even bright. I'm in a basement, five feet from it. It's not bright on full brightness. The only thing that's redeeming about this TV is the, the motion when playing video games. It's really clean, it's smooth. It looks really great, it's clean, it looks nice. And it's got really low input lag, so it's very responsive. I'll give it that. But there are zero black levels. And if you try to get black levels, you'll lose all the detail and all the richness around it. It's just awful, guys. I'm just really disappointed that I had to, to go through this whole work and this whole unboxing and this whole setup thing and all that stuff just to tear it down and bring it back. Guys, if, if you have a choice between an LG OLED and a Samsung QLED, there is no, no reason, none, to go QLED. You go OLED. There is no other TV. It's OLED or OLED. And the C10CX OLED is the best picture quality I've ever seen. Bar none, there is no doubt that OLED is untouchable. I cannot wait to have the C10 back in the RAF cave for a long time. Guys, come back to me. LG OLED fans, come back. Let's keep her going, guys. Let's make some more videos of the CX C10. It's the best. I'm tired, guys. I'm going to box up this trash TV. You guys take care. I'll see you soon. Home theater rules. Wrap out. See you.